Amy won the 150 meter pace race on Landsmot last year. If I can remember correctly, he doesn't actually have that many times in the 250 meter with this horse. No, the so 150 was kind of his thing. Yeah, Good so getting in. this far up the ladder is quite a... Oh, nice race. Look at that, we look at that. these races side by side. Going, going, so going, close. going. Yay! And we cannot that tell. One. Which Wonderful one race by these two fantastic pace riders. Fantastic pace horses. Yeah. That was probably the most exciting race. That gets your adrenaline going. Yes. Let's hear the times. So we need the times. This is exciting. Waiting for the time. So, they both improved the times. We have now for yellow, Tveitur Ráðnarsan and Tvimi from Borgaholi from Iceland, 21.52. And from Sweden, Guðmundur Einarsson with the blue, Sproti from Sjávarborg, 21.49. Oh my God! We have an improvement of both horses, and I will keep you in suspense for the yellow rider, Teitur Arnarsson, got 21.52. And for Guðmundur Einarsson and Sproti, we have 21.52. Point four nine. That is a joint position, world record position with wow. Søren Madsen from Denmark. I that never, is crazy. This is a first timer. Has to this, just be. I've never seen these good times. That's amazing. Uh, ah. <laughs> I, mean, I wonder if something has to do that. There's such a good warm up area for the pace horses. Maybe it is, and it's perfect conditions. It is a slight wind to keep them cool, but warm and nice in the air and in the air. Fantastic track. It must be. Fantastic. And yet two more really good horses to go. Yes, we have Thorvaldur Artnarsson with Dirtni from Knubbo. Yellow rider from Sweden with his fastest time is 21.62. And then we have the joint world record holder, Søren Madsen from Denmark with Haurekur from Haukoti, 21.49. They are true. now the last heat. This the is the last, last heat race and i have said before that t2 was the most exciting right this world championships i have sorry to say, that's p1 yes. this is getting this. my uh, my adrenaline going a little oh, bit more actually yeah. wow this is fantastic uh these times are just this unbelievable it's fantastic now let's hope for a really good race here and sometimes do you think they're nervous do you think they're keeping their cool I don't know. I Maybe don't even know nervous. that they can hear what the what's going on. Do you think they Maybe. can hear? Sometimes I don't know. they don't. Maybe just suspense, you know. Oh, I think there's probably some team member up there keeping them updated. Um, if they want to be updated, that is. Yes, I'm sure there is. I'm pretty and sure that Sarah Madsen wants go. to know. Oh, yes, Let's he's giving see. it his all. They know. He is going oh. for it. And Thorvaldur is in the canter. Søren is in pace. Let's and he see. is Thor going. Lander trying to make Søren go quicker there. Oh, hard to tell, hard know. to tell. I don't know. Is this going to be faster? Look at that. We have a time. We have a time. Let's see what that time will be. Yes, you could see Thorvaldur trying not to go in front of Søren. And therefore going up and canter. So we're waiting for the time for Blue Rider, Sir and Matze. still has the time, 21.49, the world record, together with Gulmundur Einarsson.
There was a time for certain men, and apparently. But unfortunately, no improvement. The time was 21.79. This fastest time was still 21.79. So, no improvement for Søren Madsen. He got a seven, no, 21.79. But I need to mention here that Søren has four times, and two, three of those four times are under 22. And now he is sharing a world record with Gurmundur Einarsson and Sprote Frau Schauerborg. So we have a joint first position, joint world record. This is a first, although we have had world records before. This is definitely a first. I have never heard of a joint world record and a joint first place. How exciting. It will be at three o'clock. 